What's up family, it's the Mobile Home Diva and in today's video, we are gonna be touring the Maynardville Classic 76. I'm super excited to show it to you. Guys, listen, this single wide has an option for a farmhouse sink in the uh, master bedroom and also an optional office. It's light, bright, and airy, and I can't wait to show it to you. So let's get into the video. <laughs> All right, let's go in and take a look at the inside. Yeah. This is what you see when you enter the home. Look how nice and bright it is in here. Absolutely love it. Y'all know I love all of these homes, so don't jones me in the comment section. But this is your living room area. Look how big your living room area. They have it nicely decorated. I love the blue in here against the gray walls and the gray tone floors. Absolutely lovely. A lot of space in this living room. You can do what you like in here. Really pretty. Really nice. Now, they have just a regular lighting flush to the ceiling, but this space warrants a ceiling fan. That would be really nice in here. Really lovely. So, this is your living room area. It overlooks the kitchen. I love this huge island, this square island. In the middle, you have space for four nice size bar stools around this island. Really pretty, really nice and bright and airy in here. You've got black appliances against this white, these white cabinets. And I love the dark color countertops in contrast to the light colored island. So really pretty, that was a good job. Love this white porcelain sink here. Y'all know this is my favorite uh, fixture. This is my favorite faucet for a kitchen because I love the two-in-one combo. You have the sprayer in addition to the faucet. So it looks really nice. This is the shiny silver one. And normally you see the brushed nickel. So that's really pretty. This uh, home has a catacorner stove. And I love the metal look they have here with the as a backsplash. So really pretty. That is really pretty. All right, we'll open one of the cabinets and let you take a look in there. You have three shelves in these taller cabinets. And then of course you have the smaller cabinets up above. Now these are really tall cabinets and you don't have the space that you normally have over the cabinets that go all the way to the ceiling. But I love the fact that you have so much space for your storage items. So many drawers and cabinets in here, really nice. And you even have two cabinets in this island and you also have pantry space. So that is a plus. We'll take a look in this pantry. Uh oh, this is a hideaway. Look at here, y'all. It's not a pantry, it's the laundry room. Really nice, so I love that. So out the kitchen, you have your laundry room and here is your pantry here. You have shelving here for your pantry item need, needs. And then you turn the corner, you've got your laundry room area here. Love the wood look that they have on this back wall. Your wash and dryer you go there and you have space for storage. And you also have space in here for a deep freezer. Look how big this laundry room is. Really nice. What a nice surprise. Very nice. So again, you have space for a deep freezer and you have pantry space in here. And I really thought it was cabinets. So well done. Well done. So you have the magnetic close closure there and nobody will ever know unless you open it. So really pretty. Really nice. Now this kitchen also has uh, it looks like sliding glass patio doors, patio doors. I think it does it slide they yeah they got it locked at the bottom Push that lock but you've got your sliding glass patio doors there 
So just imagine a nice deck out the back. You can barbecue, you can hang out, you can have it covered or not, really up to you, but that's a nice area. And because you have this large island, you don't have to worry about additional dining room seating in this kitchen. So what a nice plus. Now I'm gonna spin around and let you take a look from the kitchen into the living room. My partner is giving you an idea of what it looked like to have guests. <laughs> and then we'll go take a look at the additional bedrooms in the back. Very nice. So you got this long hallway here. First door to the left is going to be a bedroom. So you got a nice size bedroom, really bright in here. Love it. You got a standard closet over there. And this is another view of the bedroom. I'll let you see the closet. Really nice. So that's your additional bedroom number one. Next to your additional bedroom, you have your bath. Love it. Standard bathroom. Everything you need. Really nice. So that's your additional bathroom. And then you have additional bedroom number two down here. Slightly larger room. Really nice. I'll go over here and spin around and let you see it from this end. So there's your additional bedroom and then your closet for this room. Really pretty. All right. So we got three, two bedrooms and a bath on this end. And then we'll go through the kitchen and take a look at the master down this hall. Here's your master. Nice size master. Got a very large window in here. More natural light in this room. And you got a separate closet from your bathroom. Always a plus. Really nice. So that's the master. You got this long or this deep master closet. Really nice. And no carpet in this house at all, you guys. So that's always a plus so much easier to keep clean all right so that's your master closet and then next to the master closet you have the master bath you walk in and this deep garden tub greets you i love that they also have the wood look on this wall and that they have shelving for towels and things like that you can make it a real spa look so really nice. You've got a double sink here with drawers and cabinets. Your toilet sits next to the double sinks. And then you have a shower right here. So really nice. All you need in a master bath. Really nice. All right. So we have toured the Maynard, you guys. This is a single wide. The name of it is the Maynard. The Maynard all-in set up delivery heating and air steps and decks for this three-bedroom, two-bath is $99,900 all-in price. Of course, you know these prices are subject to change if you order them and add upgrades, but off the lot, these are the homes. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.